A new person coming into your life is emotional, is cute, is soulful, joyful, has a big heart, maybe secretive and mysterious and alluring, and maybe one you'd want to marry and hold on to. Very, very attractive as well, mesmerizing. Okay, someone may be really attracted to you as they see you. This could be a fire sign or doesn't have to be a fire sign it's just someone that really they say i dream of you um i can't help but be i don't know hopeful that you are mine you're mine and lustful as well so there's someone that's very lustful after you could be that new love a lot of attention someone may want to marry you or create happiness with you or a lot of babies perhaps but they want to create that bubbly they really adore you I feel like this person really likes your energy they dream of you they they dream of you like this person creates life with you they just sit there and think of you the king of pentacles this person could be wealthy or very intelligent or both you know, diligent, hardworking. This person may want to impress you, may want to impress you financially as well. They want to take you traveling. I feel like that. They love you too. King of Wands. This person may have marriage on their mind as well. Because There may be connections also. Um, Cause I feel like someone is serious about you too. I like your mind. I like your mind and the things that you think about. And they like the fact that you may just be focused on your visions right now. It's very powerful. They think you have a powerful brain, militant, disciplined, determined, and a loving heart, soul, body, and energy. I feel like that is what they're attracted to about you. They do think you're creative. And I want to tell you that you are the captain of the ocean especially as the queen of cups here captain of the ocean you may be ready to settle down for some in some way shape or form cancer or you may not be i feel like this new person that's coming into you that may be very very wealthy or super attractive or both and smart as well and loving and maybe family oriented as well. They may work a lot, honestly. This person may have, they may vacation too, but they do work. They spend a lot of time working. And they, they are, they have desires of a young person. You know what I mean? They like, um, yeah wow maybe you're not interested like maybe you this person may offer you something maybe money or something but you may say sorry you're not interested right <laughs> i'm telling you kenta this is a new person someone may be captivated by you Now they want to, so they have new feelings, new desires, like, that's why I'm saying they're dreaming of you. It's like they're thinking of all the things that they can do together with you, you know, and they, they want to create with you. This person may literally want to impregnate you, have children with you, make life with you, like with your soul. I don't know, this person wants your entire soul but you may be saying no 
cancer you may be saying sorry i'm not interested but this probably could be a soulmate connection this person could be earth sign as well we have the three of cups kisses see that's what they want to do this person just wants to be wrapped up in you they want to be with you kiss you love you and it's new it's like this person they see you the nine <laughs> yes yes so let's see ready for love i am ready about to flourish like this person is about to burst they they may be coming into you to tell you how they feel so it says be ready expectation <laughs> and it is this person seven oh my gosh the seven of swords so you may be re re remaining stern or st strict or determined or focused cancer and you may really block or deny this connection or move away from it or literally tell this person to go on like the you know <laughs> queen you are but um it could also be this person's vibration where they're very focused it's as if at first you wouldn't think that you could be with this one you know like you don't you don't you, you you're not seeing it possible any at all where this could be your soulmate I feel like that's how you feel like it could be the person you would least expect yourself to be attracted to but that could be the point it's like maybe you're normally attracted to a certain kind of people but maybe this one that's about to come around this new love they'll be so different than what you expect you may be like no i'm not interested and maybe this is what makes you so attractive to this person you know <laughs> that's what they like i feel like this person i've met them sometime before or something in a dream because i can understand why they pursue you you know it's like they feel like they know you they feel like you're it's like i say i feel that like i've met this person before in a dream that is how they feel about you they look at you and they say, "Wow, well, maybe you remind them of their grandmother or something. They look at you and they're like, wow, I feel like I've met you before in a dream. Because they can't quite put their finger on it. But they know something about you has happened before. You know? So I see dreaming. Dreaming again. This person may have been married before new destination decision by desires so they're really into you and they're making a decision re based upon this feeling that's why i'm saying it's a chase they're really going to pursue you they may write you letters and i feel like books or newspaper energy or things to read <sighs> something like that and then I have the six of um, pentacles, which is dazzle, flirt, give you some attention. Yeah, this person is going to give you gifts, maybe gifts of books, things to read. Like they're going to, uh, like they want to get to know you because they feel like they do. Like they may, I feel like strongly a book. Look, zing. This is the zing energy, a sign. A sure sign like you have similar values decent values a fine mind similar values and they don't think this is luck they think this is a truly valuable connection that's why they're pursuing you like they want you to even though this person may be wealthy and all of that I feel like they do spend a lot of time reading or sitting by the fireplace and they like puzzles maybe not puzzles but this person enjoys reading you know they feel like you'd be a good counterpart a good mate wow a good mate 
four of hearts, giving a piece of your heart, a piece of mind, my love, beyond satisfaction. Home is where the heart is. But maybe you're saying, no, I can't give you my love. This person is saying it is hard not having you. <laughs> so this is this person wants like this familiar feeling of love. They want it in their home. I want to see how like they want you there. Just you smiling, just you. And as, it's like as much as this person is the king of pentacles, they would surrender to you as woman or man. I don't know. So if you're a man, this woman, and she will surrender, she will give you her time. Or you may want to give her more of your time. So if you're male cancer, I feel like you may just want to be spending a lot of time now with someone. You may just be cold. You like may just feel like there isn't any connection around you. You may be dreaming of what your ideal partner would be like. Maybe having hope, creating that new vision. So someone says they're separate from you. Let's make love, but there's no intimacy. All right, Cancer. Well, I think maybe in the future you may be ready if you feel clear in mind, organized, light-hearted. If you have a clear energy then you may be interested in this person like and like when you're wealthy as well create some heat so maybe i feel like that's the time you may be ready to create magic to make love to give your energy to share your energy all of that because it's you know you're going to be more confident more happy more secure you don't want to be dependent on anything, anyone really, for anything. That's the truth. That's the truth. And, um, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there may be someone new again who is your soulmate moving into you. A new love. Wow. So, wow. Like, I don't know. There's another person maybe. Who is your soulmate. As well. So we had that zing energy. Now we have a new love who. This could be anyone. <laughs> could be earth sign, water sign, fire sign. Is a soul tie signed contract. So this may be one you would marry because you feel more of a soul connection to this person. You feel more comfortable. And I feel you feel come more comfortable with this person because it feels like you'll be able to predict what's going on, to control, to maintain balance. You know, this could be an, a water sign that you love a past soulmate connection with the six of cups, natural vibes. Deeply in love, naturally in love, familiar feeling of love. You know, so you may want to go back to that familiar feeling of love, even if this is a new person coming in. But then there's another person that's interested in you, which is a new, like, new, maybe this is a new sign, a sign that you would never thought you'd be interested in. Right? And if it's almost like you're, you would be scared, afraid, to give someone new a try because you don't know how you'll get along you don't know you just you're you're, you're afraid so i feel like you want to stick with what you would call your soulmate because it makes you feel more in control well that's why i feel like you're working on yourself to heal 
because you don't want to deal with those kind of things no more. True love, you like you want to fill your own soul, your own space, being clear connection with yourself, alignment with you, your well being, and your love, your money, and your circle, your family. All right, I hope you found these messages interesting and is able to help you on your journey if you did like the video share it with those you love subscribe to the channel come back again for whenever i upload new content for you your support is abundantly appreciated and i will see you next time bye